After the University of Georgia retained its back-to-back -back national championships, their defensive lineman, Jalen Carter, was in a street race with the school recruiter, Miss Chandler LaCroix. In the early morning hours, they were both racing on the street, and Miss LaCroix hit speeds of 104 miles per hour, hit a curb, launched into two power poles, and then hit two different trees. There was an offensive lineman, Devin Willick, who was in the back seat behind her that was ejected from the vehicle. He was pronounced dead at the scene. Miss LaCroix was later taken to the hospital and then was also pronounced dead. The father of Devin Willick has now filed a $40 million lawsuit against the University of Georgia because Miss LaCroix was driving a school vehicle at the time that she was engaging in that speed race. The plaintiffs are alleging that the school knew that Miss LaCroix had a bad driving record. What do you think about holding the school responsible for what the school recruiter did? Put your comments below.